What's up, ladies and gentlemen and fellow misfits? Today, we're going to discuss a life-changing book, Michael Singer's The Untethered Soul. If in any way you're feeling like you're in a funk or you're stuck creatively, professionally, personally, then you don't want to... Hold on a sec. Someone's on my property. Hamlet? i got to show you this. To be or not to be, that is the question. Uh, excuse me, Hamlet? That's actually not the question. If you read The Untethered Soul, he tells you there's actually a better question. What about my, my uncle and my father's ghost? All the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune. I know it sounds all good and dramatic, but you don't need to focus on that anymore. The struggle's over. In case you haven't noticed, you have a mental dialogue going on inside your head that never stops. If you're smart, you'll take the time to step back, examine this voice, and get to know it better. What was that? The explaining, the narrating, the fixating on things, you know, the, the mulling over of everything. I'm screwed. Totally screwed completely. Hey, can I, can I ask you something? I've always wondered this. You're Danish, right? How come you have a British accent? I just can't get this stuff out of my head. At least you know that much. The more good it does me. I want to read you something. If you want to free yourself, you must first become conscious enough to understand your predicament. My uncle killed my father and married my mother. I understand my predicament. It's a start. He meant about the misery and the voices, the way the mind keeps stirring up problems. Listen, if I didn't have these problems, I wouldn't be who I am. Remember Billy Shakespeare? Yeah, they're written into me. It's probably like that for all of us. Especially me. I get it, but, but this guy right here, Michael Singer, He's, he's written a way out of it. He, he found a way out. My head's exploding. I'm supposed to be plotting my father's revenge. Take a day off. This may help you. The more you're willing to just let the world be something you're aware of, the more it will let you be who you are. What does that mean? Who you really are. That's the question. Not the other one, to be or not to be, but to be what? Who you are. That's the question. That's why, that's why I interrupted you. You know, we've been told a lie. They put labels on us and, and ask us the wrong questions. What do you want? What do you want to be? No, I already am. The rest of it is history and personal circumstance. So, who are we? Well, I, I kind of just told you, but you're going to have to read the book. Oh, leave me alone. What a rogue and peasant slave I am. Good morning. How are you? Oh, Chipper. I see you've got your cup of coffee and a positive attitude. Good for you. Apparently you're not dealing with a your father's ghost who's come back to command you to kill your uncle. I just took the dog for a walk. How nice. Tell me, can your singer fellow sing us a song out of this? I don't think he's a singer. It's just a name. I realize. Here's a book if you want it. How about a summary instead, Mr. Smart Pants? You notice how the mind is constantly working, causing you to chase the next thought? Well aware, yes. Well, will all that chasing change anything? The doing will. If I can finally make the decision to take that dagger! Oh, let's take a step back. No daggers. It's like this. 
there's you and there's there's your awareness. You're aware that you're aware. I'm aware that I'm aware. Yeah, that's that's your identity. That's who you really are. The rest of it's superficial. All that stuff, Hamlet, the Denmark, the mom, the dad, the uncle, Ophelia. Oh, please. Ah, oh, don't mention Ophelia. No. Do you see what I'm getting at? You're the witness behind it all. Hamlet. Hamlet! I need to do this. I need to fulfill my destiny. To be unconditionally happy. That's what he says in the book. That's the real choice. To be or not to be happy. To go beyond the mind's dramas. No, mate. To avenge my father's death. You're back so soon. Well, I am known for my indecision. Anyway, I've, I've got to thinking about this happiness thing, and it sounds sort of appealing. Really? Helped you, didn't it? Definitely. I've totally changed my approach. I'm more relaxed, more open to life. Things don't bother me as much as they used to. Is that so? So you're gonna read it? I don't know. Indecision. I was like you at one point. Haven't we all been there? Always second guessing ourselves, torturing ourselves with doubt, creating our own prisons in our mind. I, that was me too. And a book solved all that? It's like this. I solved it, but the book pointed the way. It's up to you though. Give me that. Well, I hope after all that, the book works out for him. Well, that was definitely unplanned. For more of the unplanned, the whimsical, the inspiring, the humorous, the... I don't know what else. Uh, subscribe below, and you'll get it in your inbox. Thanks. See you soon.